Darling Day with Coldwell Banker. I'm here at 5818 Tiger Lily Circle in Montgomery, Alabama. This neighborhood has a state-of-the-art workout facility, a clubhouse, two pools, a family pool, and uh, an adult pool. It's close to East Chase Shopping Center, just a few minutes from Interstate 85. It's close to the Rave Movie Theater, a 16-screen theater, uh, close to shopping, and 20 minutes away from Maxwell Air Force Base. Let's go on in and view this beautiful home. As you enter this beautiful home, you'll notice there is a storage closet here. There is lots of storage in this house. The foyer is large. There is a beautiful light fixture here. There is upgraded lighting fixtures throughout this home. On the right, there is a half bath. It has a pocket door. And as we enter on into the home, you will enter the great room. This is a very open floor plan. It's great for entertaining. You'll notice that the uh, wide plank wooden flooring um, extends from the front door, the foyer, all the way in through the uh, formal living area into the formal dining room here. Let's go on into the kitchen. As you enter into the kitchen, you'll notice the arched doorways. This house has several of those. And you come in the kitchen, you'll see the Corian countertops. There's a little nook area here where you could put a chair, have a computer, a TV, a little workspace. This is a great feature of this kitchen. There are pull-out shelves in these cabinets. That's along all of the bottom cabinets here. That's great to organize your pots and pans. There's also an island area in the middle of the kitchen. Great for cooking and setting up all your, um, your work stuff when you're cooking. You'll notice there's lots of counter space, lots of cabinets, um, there's an eat-in area over here to the right. It's a great open kitchen, open area. And when we come back around over here, you'll see there's a large pantry, room for lots of storage, and lots of items. There's also an extra added room to this house. This is a great um, office, playroom, sunroom, whatever you'd like to have it as. The owners used to have it set up as an office. Currently they have it as a sunroom or playroom. There's a second fireplace in here. has the brick walls. There also is a door here out into the garage. This is also an exterior door that goes outside. The owners say they love to come in this room and drink coffee in the mornings in the afternoon, come and relax in here. Um, she loves to cook in here in the kitchen. She can see straight into here and watch her kids play while she's cooking, have the TV on and watch TV while she's cooking. It's just a great room added on here to the kitchen. Off the kitchen we have the laundry area, mudroom area. This is a great room for those rainy days. It comes right in from the garage. You can leave your wet shoes. Kids can drop off their backpacks here. Up here we've got some additional shelving. Great for storage. On this side you have your washer and dryer. Again, more storage. There's some cabinets here. Shelving up here. Just lots of storage space in this area. Out here leads to the garage. It is a double garage. Both owners have large vehicles. Both their vehicles fit in here with great ease. We have shelving on both sides. Lots of shelving on this side, some shelving on this side also. A great added feature of this garage is the utility sink. One of the owners does some arts and crafts. She loves to garden. She said this is just a great feature for her. She can come in, clean up her brushes for painting, clean off her gardening utensils, and do all that right here in the garage before she comes back into the house. So that's just a great feature of this garage. The formal dining room flows right out the kitchen, makes it very easy for entertaining. You can carry your things from the kitchen into the dining room. It's open to the great room in here, great for entertaining. Um, the gorgeous light fixture you can see here is a great focal point of the dining room. As you come in here, you'll notice the columns on either side of the dining room. Those are also featured in the foyer as we came in the front door. This is such a great open floor plan. It's great for entertaining. You can see the TV from the dining room here. 
Again, you'll notice the hardwood floors that come throughout the dining room into the living room again. You'll notice across here the fireplace in the main room. It has gas logs, a gas starter. That's great on those cool nights. Have a fireplace in the fire. The master bedroom is off the main living area of the home. It is one of the three bedrooms in this house. As you enter into the bedroom, you'll notice the box ceiling and also the recessed lighting. That is a great feature of this bedroom. As we come around, you'll notice the bathroom is off here to the right. As you come in, there's 16 inch tile on the floor here. As we come in there, it's double split vanities. One is on this side of the bathroom. The other one is on the complete other side. Great for extra space when you're getting ready in the morning. There is a jetted tub in this bathroom. Great for taking a bubble bath, relaxing after a hard day. The shower is up here. It is a stand-up tiled shower. It's an extra large stand-up shower. Your other sink you can see over here. And then a separate private uh, commode room over here, which is very nice to have privacy. And then as you're leaving, you'll notice here a linen closet, which is nice to have storage in your bathroom. As we come back out the, the bedroom, excuse me, there is a very large walk-in closet here. There's lots of shelving in here. It is very large. You could get dressed in here and have your own dressing area. There's built-in shelving on each side to put your shoes, fold your clothes, whatever you prefer. And then, of course, your, your hanging racks. This is where the pull-down is for the attic. Up in the attic, there is floored space up there, so even more storage up in the attic. Off the foyer of the home are the other two bedrooms. Let's go see those now. As you enter this bedroom, you'll notice the ceiling fan. Each bedroom does have a ceiling fan. And we'll come and see the closet. This is an extra large walk-in closet. Makes for lots of storage. This bedroom does share a bathroom with the other bedroom. It's a walk-through Jack and Jill bathroom. Has beautiful tile floor. As you'll come in and see, it does have a beveled glass mirror and a linen closet for more storage. Like I said before, just lots of storage in this house. And as we come in through this bedroom, you'll see the crown molding. There is crown molding in every room of this home. Just a great feature of this house. One thing I want to just feature of this bedroom is this closet. This is a fantastic closet. They have added custom shelving. These pull-out drawers. Just adds a lot of extra room, a lot of storage in here. A lot of added space in this closet they had done. I'm outside relaxing on the back patio of this home now. This is a great backyard, has the patio with a covered area here, has recessed lighting up there so it would be great for the evening after a long day at work. It also has a deck that extends out from the patio. The owners like to grill out. This is a grill that has a gas line that goes in so no need for a tank for your gas grill. You can just use the gas line. Like I said, there's a deck. It extends off this way. A nice large backyard. The owners have a dog, so if you have pets, their dog has really enjoyed this backyard. It's just a great entertaining area or enjoyment area if you want to relax back here in the evenings or on a Saturday afternoon. It's a wonderful backyard. I'm Darlene Day with Coldwell Banker Town Realty. I'm glad you came to view 5818 Tiger Lily Circle today. I hope you enjoyed what you saw. Please call me at 334-220-2134. I'd love to show you this property in person. Thank you.